Hello everyone, 42% health here. Welcome back to Hell Revealed 2. Uh, we are about to play map 26 of Hell Revealed 2. Uh, this is called Dis 2000. Yeah, it's not showing up on the map screen. But uh, I think my what this map always makes me think of is on Captain Planet's channel for one of his a sec. The, uh, the line here between the light and dark sections is actually a non-crossable line for monsters. So, it actually kind of helps to know that a little bit. Oh, I did not need that. But one of his, uh, custom wad showcases was actually a unreleased early version of this exact map. And he was having all kinds of trouble with it. Uh, part of the problem, of course, being that this wad in particular, and the the pre-release, or this wad in general, and the pre-release version in particular, were not designed with pistol starting in mind. So it was like almost impossible. It was really hard. Well, I say that, um, but almost impossible back then. Uh, is, you know, kind of proving to be actually somewhat easy nowadays. Uh, we get a chain gun sniping session. Am I even reaching that far? I'm kind of thinking that we can't reach each other. Die! Thank you. Okay. So yeah, I was... I was, uh, for a while... I was trying to actually max that that early version of this map, not even knowing it was in this wad. Well, I think it said in the text file that it was made for this wad, but it had been rejected or something like that. So, I didn't... I knew it was made for Hell Revealed 2, but I didn't know it was actually in it. So it took me a little by surprise when I came across this level and realized that it was all familiar. But yeah, there's, there's some differences. Also, right up here is a block line. Like, the Spectres can't even get to you if you stand right here. I don't know why they nerfed all these fights so much with monster block lines. It's kind of sad, because it's otherwise a really good wad. Well, it's, it's otherwise it's an okay wad. It's a bad wad with some good parts. That, by the way, is not the final Mastermind fight. There is a lot of this level. As you saw, there's that big courtyard. Also, this part of the map was bugged out in the early release version so that when you entered this room and then exited, you couldn't get back in, but there's like all the ammo that you need is in there, but you can't survive in there with the starting weapons. 
So, yeah. There's all this. There's all these resources in here. You guys need to let me out now. I'm dead. And I don't think I've saved at all. Good grief. Those are some good rocket shots. If I do say so myself. Okay. And again, these monsters can come in here, but they can't enter this light sector, so... It's like there's no point to these pinkies now either. They just eat your ammo, that's all. There is a Zerk. You know what we could do? We could try to place a rocket right, right there. Yes! No, you guys need to go clump up more before I give you a rocket. And that one missed. That one's gonna miss. There. Alright, let's drop a save. Uh, you know what I should have done is check my video. I've gotten kind of lazy in recent days about making sure that my videos are actually like everything's good before moving on. I mean, before proceeding to record the next video. Because if everything's not good, then I end up recording lots of footage with problems, sometimes overriding saves. Like, I just overwrote that HR2 save. And, uh... Which was kind of foolish, because I don't even know if the previous video worked. And if I have to re-record it, then I've just lost my saves. Which leads me to my biggest complaint about PR Boom <laughs> being the limited number of save slots. It's like it. I know it's trying to emulate vanilla, but you can have vanilla compatibility without limited save slots, and it really is a modern source port in that it allows, like, you to adjust mouse sensitivity and all that jazz. It has free look, etc, etc. Alright, so let's head back around. Let's go back into this room where I died before. Let's save. Let's 
pull these guys toward this side of the room. Push the button. Do better than we did last time. Maybe not wake up those barons out there right away. Oh, they woke up anyway. How do I get out? Oh, I can just open the door. Fair enough. Well, you better believe I'm rocketing all these jokers. Be careful because that mastermind can shoot you through the window. So that's why I'm kind of like going to the sides instead of standing there. I think I took all the shells. Which means I should kill this guy with bullets. Pew, 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 pew. So there's that. Was this maybe a chute to open? Nope. I think that switch over there opened it. Uh, but this isn't so bad, because... Yes, there is an archfile that's going to come around here and try to resurrect all these guys. Oh, there's... Two archer piles, I stand corrected. Oh, that was close. I did not have enough health to tank an arch file hit, so that would have been fatal if he hadn't died. Okay, that leads back out. We need to come fight this mastermind finally. Um, what do we want to use on this guy, Gal? I'm inclined to save BFG just because... Just because... I know what's coming next. But this feels like inefficient as sin. We all know how inefficient sin is. Okay. Spider gal, you are wrecking me. Congratulations, Mapper. This Mapper successfully found a situation where the plasma gun was more desirable than the BFG. Actually, not really. I should have just used the BFG and rushed her. Okay, let's grab all these. There's a red key in here. And, yeah, as soon as you grab the red key, cacos start spawning in like crazy. Like crazy. The unfortunate thing is it's just this easy circle straight fight.
I can save myself a lot of ammo by using something that harms more than one Kako at a time. Yeah, you also want to be careful how you use your rockets because splash damage will cause them to fly outwards. So normally good good rocket usage is trying to shoot into the crowd. Like you try targeting the monster that's like the deepest in the crowd that you can hit. Or if you want to hit the ones on the surface, you just try to, you know, aim for a monster that's somewhat behind the front monsters, you know. You know what I'm trying to say. Please, give me that. Thank you. But uh, that might not work so well here, because if you hit Cackles in the center, then all the ones on the outside go flying toward the edges, and then you lose your grouping. No! Ah. Oh. There. I'm sorry, folks. That was stupid of me. Let's do this. Just to make it interesting. Oh, I thought there were monsters in there. Maybe they will still come out here. Yeah, that's what you want to save your rockets for. They can't cross that line? Oh, why? Actually, now that I think about it, yeah, that's, uh, that lowers, like, a lift or something. But that eventually raises back up or something so you can cross up there. As you can tell, we've already been up there. I believe that's that little sector where we picked up the rocket launcher. Boink, boink. Save this time. I took a lot of damage from those imps. Surprising, actually. Oh, come on. You took three rockets. You should be almost dead. There is a secret back there, and I cannot remember how to open it. But I, uh, if I remember correctly, you come back to it later. So. All the Mancu buses.
Mancubi are tricksy little hobbitses, I'm telling ya. See, dodging all their projectiles is very hard when they come in groups. Ow. I am almost dead. Oh, you know what? We got that Berserk back at the start. And a blue armor back there. I should go grab those. Run! Run! Okay, we good. Low on rockets. But we will live. We're also low on shells. Huh. Shells right here. Ow, nice shot, pal. Wish my rockets could do that. Sure, I actually needed that. Sure, let's just take all the things. That was nice while it lasted. Nice! That was fun. Okay, we got some more rockets. I believe this opens the door? Nope. Red key. Yeah, red key door. Okay, let's save. Uh, how do I want to handle these guys? Actually, let's lure them all over here because I know there's arch vials and a cyber demon that spawn in there. Once we grab the key. And more mancubi. Ha ha! Kill each other! Slay each other, my minions! Ah, oh, this is great. Zippity doo da, zippity a. My oh my, what a wonderful day! Cyber Demon, get busy. Why is he targeting me? Oh, I think I know why. Dang it. I must have started this Let's Play before I changed my compatibility settings. So yeah, infighting in the uh, MBF format, which is the default for PR Boom Plus. Infighting is broken. Why am I doing that? Let's do this. Because it's fun. Oh, he was almost dead. Oh well. 
Should I? I'll save that. Uh, I remember this part being hard. Uh, I think it's chain gunners. I think when you grab this, uh, bars pop up around you and chain gunners are at these three sides. Oh, come on! Oh, I'm out of, never mind, I'm out of rockets. Uh, this is not good. Where do I get more rockets? Game! Give me rockets! The game's not gonna give me rockets, is it? Oh, duh. Behold, we have rockets. How do I get out? That way. Thank you. I'm not going to waste 80% of a cell pack. Because there are more Mancu buses. That's not why. Because there's a big, big boss fight out here later on. You know what? I've got plenty of cells to spare. Let's do this. Just fill her up. Now I'm curious about something. So before I go fight those spiders, let's go see if that secret opened up. No, it didn't. I don't even remember what was in it. I just remember it being there. And the maybe it's not even there in this version. Maybe it's in the old version. It's so noisy! You guys have really loud feet! Ta-da! Nice, okay, I will take this. Why does this lift not make any noise? Um, 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 um. 
You know the drill. If you've played slaughter maps before, it's just bring everything toward the center, and I came down here again, and now I'm bringing everything toward the back. Ow! Oh, that was not good. He didn't take any rocket damage. There um, mm -hmm. we go. I think I remember chain gunners being here. BFG. It's just the best gun there is. Uh, I think I'll save that. He thinks that grabbing the blue key spawns a cyber demon? No? Oh, okay. We get boss fight time. One health. Let's go back and see if that secret's open now. No! What do I need to do to open that secret? Also, I hate this texture. <laughs> if you've done any Doom mapping, uh, you know that, that that's what that texture looks like. Like, the... Why don't you put the seam on the edge instead of offset like that? Like, you can offset it and make it look proper, but I don't understand why they don't have it offset and looking proper by default. Kill each other, my minions. Oh, here we go. They are the last two monsters. Yeah, I believe you need the blue key for this. That starts the thingy lowering. Exit teleporter. That's what I'm trying to think of. Did I leave armor anywhere? Oh, uh, yes, I know I did. Oh, there's some. Anyway. I think there's blue armor the other way, so... I'm gonna go for that. And I don't know where the other two secrets are. I think I know where that one is, but I haven't been able to open it. Run, run, run! So yeah, anyway, this is a fun level. I enjoy it for the most part. Like most of the levels in this part of the WAD. Done. Nice. Oh yeah, this is like the iconic Hell Revealed 2 level. So, I will see you guys here next time, and I'll just uh, 
yeah, I'll see you guys here next time. I don't know what else I'm going to do. <laughs> Alright, thanks for watching, everyone. Take care. Bye for now.